Hello guys, this is Peter and you are looking AVA Group Media channel. Today I will show you this Western Digital My Passport Wireless Pro uh, external hard drive. It is stuffed full with fantastic features. I will show you today. Shall we? And this is the box of the Western Digital My Passport Wireless Pro external hard drive. This hard drive has a built-in 6400 mAh battery. The boss claims it works 10 hours with it. I would say 10 hours standby time. But anyway, it's a great item. It my, this unit has 4 terabyte hard drive inside and uh, it's great. This is how it looks. It fits in my hand, fairly small. On the side you find an SD card reader. It means I put the SD card inside and according to the settings it starts automatically copy everything on the hard drive or I have to push this button and it starts to copy everything over. As you see, this button also shows how many battery lives we still have. Beside the SD button, we have a USB-A port. It means with this 6400 mAh battery, I can charge my items. Although, if I use it as a charger, the item itself can run less and less time on his own battery. We have also a USB 3 connection with the USB 3 cable. We can connect it with our computer and access everything which is on it. As it says, it is wireless. This means we can access it directly from our cell phone and we can access it through the local wireless network from the computer or from the cell phone anytime and browse all the items are stored here inside nothing else to do we should look for the software and this is the web page of uh, this item we can see how many battery power we have here we can see that uh, the hard drive is connected through the local network to a computer it is a 4 terabyte item. Under Wi-Fi, we can set the Wi-Fi server settings for the item and we can set the local network it should connect to. Under admin, we can set the password, the language. We can enable uh, SSH and FTP access. By hardware, we can set that the unit should run in a performance mode or in a battery life mode. To be honest, the difference is very small, so I leave it always in battery life mode. We can lock the drive, it means the next time we can access all the items on it if this button is activated, if we connect it by USB cable to a computer. The item has a built-in Plex media server and a Twonky server. It means by a smart TV, for example, we can access all the data on the hard drive directly with the TV. And here below are the settings for the automatic save. Uh, we can set for the SD card and for a USB device if it should be saved automatically, if it is plugged in, and if it should save all the data or only the new data. And the item can update his uh, firmware automatically 
if it has an internet connection. The SD card imports, automatic or not, are in the storage SD card imports folder. Every time I put an SD card in, it makes a folder with the actual date and with the time. And inside these folders, we can find the data the device saved for the SD card. You can buy this item on the internet. I didn't buy it from this seller, but for the same 215 euros. Uh, it's a very smart item, uh, full with functions. It works very fast, very easy. I guess every cent of these 215 euros was a very, very good investment. If you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe for the channel and share this video with your friends. See you next time. And this is the box of the Western Digital Wire. And this is the box. And this is the box of the Western Digital My Passport Wireless Pro external uh, And this is the box of the Western Digital My Passport uh, Wireless Pro external hard drive. Hard drive. And this is the box of the Western Digital My Passport Wireless Pro external hard drive.